on Saturday. 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 So naturally now, what we've got to start doing is planning for next month. What I'm going to do, um, just so you guys can prep, and maybe whoever's doing that, put the word out on Slack. Um, what I'm going to do, um, what, what we've been doing the last little bit was, for, for a little while, if you go back a few months ago, um, here in Clearfield, I was doing our, our own meetings in my office. And we went through some things. Um, then we kind of uh, combined with Team Brown for a little bit. We kind of did you know, a little bit there. Um, and we'll probably go back to some of that. But periodically, it's a, it's a good time, or, you know, it, it can be very timely and very effective to come together as a smaller group. In a lot of cases, um, in business, we can, we can get too broad in our perspective, and we, we end up um, not being specific enough for the, for the needs of the few. And so um, I think we'll switch back and forth depending on the needs, you know. Uh, certainly I just want to remind you guys of this thought, and that is when you identify a need that you have, let me know. You know, if you feel like you're struggling in a certain area, that's a great opportunity to pull aside and do our own thing and just kind of cater to that individual need. Um, because it's probably, if you're struggling with it, it's probably something that somebody else can also benefit from. But what I want to do this week, and I'm going to do this in South Jordan and here in Clearfield, is I'm going to do uh, the entire training as um, this sheet. So it's been, you know, you know the sheet, but it's been a little while. Um, and so I want to go over it, but I'm also not just going to go over it. We're going to actually fill it out during that training session. So just had Don burn off a bunch of these. And maybe, depending on how that feels to you and how it feels to me, maybe we'll do that once a month where we, we focus on that. Um, and then what I'd like to do for the entire month of September is I'd like to bring, I'd like to have you bring these goal sheets to the meeting and then let's review those either in the training or at dinner afterwards and just see. I think, it, I think it's helpful to increase the accountability of what's going on. I've, you know, anything you've struggled with, I've struggled with, you know, and then some. Um, sometimes it's just good to know that you've got an answer to somebody, and I, I say that cautiously, you know, because I, I don't want you to feel like, you know, there's no boss persona here. But but if you put down somebody on inventory and then we we spend some time briefly going through each person's and depending on the size, but we could pretty well do that in South Jordan and in Clearfield in a meeting right now. Cause there's there's not too many people to be able to, to do that. But I would like to be able to say, okay, Don, let's let's hear a report on on yours, and and then you go through and report, and then not just the numbers, but I want us I want us to get more focused on, do you know the names that go with those numbers, you know? So for you to say, you know, I want you know two recruits this month but I don't have any recruiting possibilities, that's still doable. But that probably isn't realistic on a consistent basis. You know, I've certainly had times where I've gone into a month or a week and I haven't had inventory, but I've still had goals and I've gotten the goals done. But obviously if that's your general game plan, it's not gonna work out every week. So, um, so I just wanna get better at managing the the goals against the actual inventory so i can say to john okay john you 
what was your goal this month? Two sales? You were trying to get two two recruits and a, and a three sales. Right? Three sales and, and a recruit. So I say to John, okay, Don, uh, last week when we heard from you, um, and then I have a copy and you have a copy, um, you said um, that you were focused on this and this and this. How's that going? But to be able to say individually, did you get together with John Folk? And and for you know, and it's no um, browbeating. I don't want. I'm not looking to create an uncomfortable scenario. What I'm looking to do is create a heightened awareness about what you're doing and when you're going to do it, and and hopefully compress time frames a little bit. I. I've, I've experienced it before where I have things I can get done, but I procrastinate and I don't schedule it and I don't get it done. It, it can be helpful from time to time to have somebody say, hey, um, you said you were going to get together with so-and-so, did you do that? And, you know, two or three times you say no, and it hopefully gets, you'll do your own brow beating. <laughs> Where you go, I don't want to say no again, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna call this guy. So, what do you guys think about that? Okay. So let's let's plan. Um, do we have uh, copy capabilities at South Jordan? I don't think we do, do we? Yeah. Yeah, it's on the drive. It's on the same that drive. Well, I what I'd like to have is a, you know, a hand. I'm I'm gonna bring these to. South Jordan and we're going to have them here, but I want to hand them out, but then I want to copy a hard copy of each one. So is there a printing, Chris is there a printer in Chris's Chris office? Printer, yeah. So we might be able to work something out with Chris and I'll just give him a little money for... Just give him a heads up. Yeah. So let's just, uh, let's just focus on that, all right? So if you guys want to pre, I mean, you should all have copies of this anyways, right? Yeah, we do. If you want to pre-fill some of that out, what I'm specifically looking for, um, and if, again, if we find this helpful, we can do it each month over and over again, but I'm just looking for creating a more unified, you know, understanding of what it takes to hit those goals consistently to where you eventually get to the point where you go, okay, if I go into a month and I want to get one recruit, I really have to have four people that I'm working with. Because I've learned that over the last six months or whatever, right? So um, I think that'll be helpful. All right? All right. Sweet. Trying to think what else. Oh, <laughs> crap. You won't be here. I'll be here Wednesday. <clears throat> so, Don, you going to do it? So you guys grab our group and go in my office and do it. Um, let's see, California though is an hour. Yeah, I won't be able to. So it'll be with Rich and Cindy at Pebble Beach. So I fly out. That's a hard choice. Yeah. <laughs> Does he have a gym? <laughs> Believe me. Uh, um, so I fly out very early Wednesday, and then I fly back in very late Thursday night. That was just a two-day deal. Um, but that'll be great stuff to talk about Saturday. I have my kids this weekend, so I'll roll in during my part. I may also put that on Slack is that um, anybody who can needs to be here in person on Saturday for a recap of the Folly Retreat. In fact, I may, I may put out a post to the SMDs and suggest a group training Saturday morning. All right, that's it. Awesome. Yeah, there we go.